What's up everybody, Beastly Gamer here playing some Call of Duty Advanced Warfare on PS4. I want to talk to you guys about Advanced Warfare, best first person shooter I've probably ever played. Uh, and if you are like me playing this game throughout the week and maybe considering doing some share play on the weekend, letting some other buddies of yours get into it and try it with the share play feature, you can just put a big X on that right now. Call of Duty Advanced Warfare for the PlayStation 4 does not support share play. Uh, and uh, this article is on GameSpot.com. The PlayStation 4 edition of Call of Duty Advanced Warfare blocks share play functionality. Internal tests at GameSpot show that Activision has marked all gameplay footage as censored, which does not affect the owner's console but ensures that gameplay cannot be streamed to another user. Activision's block on share play functionality comes little more than a week after Sony claimed that the feature would work on all games. It marks the latest setback for Sony following weeks of major update and network problems. SharePlay allows two PS4 owners to play the same single copy of a game over the internet. The owner is designated as the host and can stream gameplay footage to a guest console. The host can also relinquish control of the game to the guest too effectively giving another user the chance to play without paying. While share play is limited to 60 minutes per session, users can return to the mode immediately after the time ends. There's no cap on share play sessions either, meaning that a game can effectively be streamed indefinitely. When the concept was presented during a media briefing in late October, Sony was questioned by GameSpot about whether all third-party publishers were on board with the system. At the time, Sony representatives told GameSpot that SharePlay works across all PS4 games. When asked whether publishers could opt out, the representatives suggested that there was no existing option to do this. When asked to clarify on the, the matter further, the representatives offered an unequivocal indication that SharePlay will work on all released PS4 games, providing they do not need an additional peripheral. However, built into the system is a sensor option for publishers which was intended to circumvent spoilers being revealed to a guest console. Though it was thought this sensor would be limited to certain scenes only, Activision appears to have extended it and crossed the entire game. Representatives for Sony and Activision were unable to comment at the time of this going to the press. Uh, an update, Sony has issued GameSpot with a statement clarifying that not all games work with shared play. What do I think about this? I think it's unfortunate. I think that um, SharePlay is an awesome feature. I've only uh, used it once. I, I used it with my brother and uh, he played uh, and he said there was no noticeable lag or anything. So I think it really works well and uh, I think it's you know revolutionary in, in the home console space to be able to do something like that. Activision, is this right that they did this? Probably not. This is a little shady. Yeah, it's a little shady to mark all gameplay footage as censored footage. I mean, I can I can kind of understand, uh, you know, censoring maybe cutscenes, you know, uh, censoring you know uh, copywritten music and stuff like that. That is a little bit more understandable. But to censor the entire game, that's a little shady. That's a little unscrupulous. Uh, the fact that they don't want to, to allow you to to do this, play this game at all during share play is a little bit shady. Uh, another little tidbit about this information, the update, is that Call of Duty Ghost doesn't work with it either. So Activision is really, really uh, shady when it comes to allowing you to play or allow your friends to play using the share play function. Uh, hopefully other developers and publishers do not adopt this mindset because, uh, I mean, even though it's well within their right to do it just kind of puts a bad taste in the mouth of gamers, especially people who prefer the game share, people who want to let people, like me personally, I would like to let some of you guys play some of these games. Uh, and let me know in the comment section if you guys would like to share play some of these newer games. I'll let you guys play. I don't care. I mean, I'm all in it for, for you guys. For me, I think it's fun. I think it's an awesome new feature. But if the, if the publishers and the developers of these games are opting out and using this censor feature and censoring the entire game. I think that's a little shady. And uh, hopefully Activision changes this. Hopefully they, they, they set it right in the near future and at least allow uh, you know the multiplayer or 
aspects of single player to be played across game share because it just doesn't seem right that they would totally censor this option. You guys let me know what you think about this in the comment section below. If you like this information, support my channel with a thumbs up. And if you're new to the Beastly Gamer channel, go ahead and subscribe. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time.